As Tony just mentioned, we have been dealing with some icy roads even more so tonight into tomorrow morning. WSAZ's Addie Smith talked with the DOH about how they prepare to keep roads safe in any conditions. Joining us now with a live report on that. Yes, Taylor, with the snow we've seen today, a main concern that most people have is about the roads and how they are being treated. I spoke with Joe Pack, the chief engineer of operations with the West Virginia Division of Highways, about how they prep and treat the roads. As most mines are focused on the holiday season, the West Virginia Division of Highways is focused on keeping the roads safe. Our employees work two 12-hour shifts so that we're here to serve the needs of our drivers. Chief Engineer of Operations Joe Pack says they start prepping for the winter as early as April with refilling their salt stock piles. But they get in the full swing of things starting November 1st. We stay on the ready of constantly monitoring our inventory, our stockpiles, our vehicle condition, and making sure that our employees stay aware of the weather forecast. The West Virginia Division of Highways wastes no time after the first snow falls to get on the roads and making them as safe as possible. Then once the first snowflake falls, our trucks are out on the roadway. We apply rock salt to the road and we plow the roads. Keeping the roads safe requires a lot of salt. We're 231,000 tons of salt on hand in the state. That is the equivalent of more than 45,000 large elephants. While driving on icy, snowy roads, Pack says stay patient, reduce your speed, and pay attention to your surroundings. Give a lot of room to, your, to the other cars on the highway because stopping is more difficult. It takes longer on a wet road. It takes longer on a snow-covered or icy road. Impact also said when you see wet roads during the winter to still lower your speed in case it is black ice, which will make you slide. Addie Smith, WSAZ, Charleston. All right, thank you.